Dear brothers, we are getting ready for an important congregational event which I would consider significant after the last general chapter. In our changed times, the major superiors of our congregation together with the general government come together to reflect on the general chapter invitations and to ask ourselves how we can together make the congregation live its vocation in the church credibly and joyfully. One of the major concerns of this uh, meeting is to tune ourselves to the dream of God which we together weaved prayerfully during the general chapter. So one of the questions we were constantly asking, what is the Lord asking of us in our times? And that dream of God for the congregation which we have together weaved was a, was a way of articulating it with the designs and commitments. All that process was based on our desire, our call to be rooted in Christ and audacious in mission. So to be rooted in Christ audaciously is the first task. How do we live today our, our vocation, making Christ the center of our lives and do the various commitments to give him the first place? And the second thing is to be audacious as rooted persons or rooted audaciousness. A superficial heroism in mission doesn't last long. Audaciousness or audacity is of the Holy Spirit and that needs that we be rooted. Now to leave us rooted and audacious missionaries in our times, we need the grace of God. We need though to walk the synodal path listening to one another and to the Holy Spirit together. The general government had made its action plan and these plans make sense only when they are you know, when they are practiced or when they are internalized in the respective major organisms. And that will be one of the major discussions for us. The great challenge for us is to walk the talk. The chapter document and the dream and designs, etc. give a map. But a map is a map, not the territory. We need to walk in the territory to reach the goal or to realize the dream. And this is a collective journey and that's why the synodal path that the Pope is inviting us is very significant for the way we move ahead to the future. We ask all of you to pray for us and be united with us that together we make our journey forward to dream with God and to realize that dream as missionaries rooted in Christ and audacious in mission. God bless you.